you so much for being with me today. I'm going to be working on a two foot by three foot canvas today, so it's rather large. Um, hopefully I can tilt it <laughs> and not make a huge mess. I'm gonna be using white as my base coat. Then I've got some gold. This is a beautiful Arctic color by uh, Lucas Krill, and I'll put all these colors in the description. Pewter. This is a Payne's Gray. I absolutely love Payne's Gray. It's just such a beautiful color. This is a turquoise green by Grumbacher. Um, it does have a little bit of Payne's Gray in it because I wanted to deepen the color a little bit. And this is a Sapphire Blue. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna spread a little bit of base white on my canvas. Just a little thin layer. I'm just gonna spread it out some. Okay. And I'm going to be using an open cup technique. I've been doing this recently in some other videos and I really just, I just love the effects that you can get. This one I think is gonna turn out a little bit differently. At least that's what I'm hoping. It's not part of my fun and, or fun, funky and fun series, but it should turn out really pretty. All right, I'm just gonna spread this white around just a little bit, just to coat the canvas. Not to coat the whole thing just yet just to get a nice even layer all over my canvas. Yeah, and this is a big one. I put plastic down all over the place, hoping that I won't get paint just everywhere. Let me use this little spatula to kind of spread it out a little bit. Like I said, this does not have to be perfect, this part at all, because I am gonna be stretching this over the canvas anyway. I just wanna kinda Get an even coat. Okay. You can see I made some enormous air bubbles when I did that. Okay, just a hair. Okay. Okay, so I think I'm gonna start down here. I'm gonna put my cup right there. And I'm gonna layer my colors. Gold, white, there we go. Let's see. Let's do a little bit of Payne's Gray. Let's see, turquoise green. There we go. Let's see how this turns out. I hope this turns out pretty. It should. All right, I'm gonna put just a little bit of white. This white that's in my cup is the same that's in those bigger cups. So I'm just gonna put a little bit of white around it. There we go. All right, lift it up a little bit. My, lost my paint there. Okay, I'll do some more here.
All right, I'm gonna stretch it out. But I am gonna add a little bit of paint on the edges just to help it move a little bit easier. I think I've got enough paint, but just wanna make sure it slides well. Okay. I haven't torched or anything yet, and you can see all the different cells that I'm getting. Just a real cool effect. Go that way. I'll go on down with it. Bring it back. You can hear it running. <laughs> right, I'm gonna go this way with it. It's heavier than you think with all that paint. Put a little bit on the corner here. It's not wanting to move as well. Might as well go ahead and do it over here too. There we go. Loving it. Loving it. I'm going to tilt it this way. I know it's hard to get in camera, so I apologize if you can't see it really well. But it is looking super cool. All right. Put this over here. So it'll slide better. There we go. I want some of this to come on down. Let's see what's the best way. I'm gonna hold the bar on the bottom. Which means my arm is gonna get painted. <laughs> That's all right. Okay. Boy, did it ever. <laughs> I don't know if you can see my arm. I am painted. Okay, I'm gonna go back this way. Just hair. This is so pretty. I really, really love this. There we go. Hope you can see it. Let's go just down that corner, far corner. Just a hair more. Getting my workout today. Wow. Oh, I love it. Absolutely gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous. I'm going to bring you down for some details. Um, I do think that I want to maybe blow this a little bit or something. I don't like that big white going through it, but it is a beautiful piece. I will see you in just a second and show you all the details. I think I just created the most beautiful piece that I've ever done. I cannot wait to see this one dry. It is just absolutely gorgeous. It's got so many details. Beautiful lacing. Really soft areas. Just has a beautiful flow to it. I love this right here. It looks really dark. It's got some, sh some shine that's gonna dry or gorgeous. I love the way this dark area with the soft next to it. I cannot wait for this one to dry. This one can't dry fast enough for me. <laughs> All the 
gorgeous blues and green. So soft right here. Yeah. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and give it a thumbs up. And as always, you have a great day. Until next time, bye.